Hi, I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty and I'm excited that you're here with me today to see my first report on the Dr. Brandt No Needles Neck Sculpting Cream. Yes, that's right. Four weeks ago, I did a first video on this new product and I have to say, I thought maybe it was going to be a gimmick because all of us have this kind of neck waddle stuff and increasingly after my 60th year especially, I started noticing that I was getting this little turkey waddle, this little crepey patch of skin here and I just thought that quite realistically I was going to have to watch that get worse and worse over the years. Well, I have been really kind of blown away by the results of this product. It was not anything I expected and they say it takes six to eight weeks to see results but after my first four weeks I really kind of think I am seeing results and I'll show you those pictures in just a few minutes because I was kind of astounded by the results and I plan to keep using this and I will say Dr. Brandt did send me this little kit of the No Needles Neck Sculpting Cream and this Gua Sha Stone which is a rose quartz stone but this video is not sponsored and I'm allowed to say anything I want about it and quite honestly I was not expecting the results that I've had so far although I will let you be the judge of that and I'll show you the pictures in just a few moments but first I'll go ahead and tell you about this cream in case you didn't see that earlier video and this cream is supposed to reduce skin's fatty appearance below the chin it's supposed to moisturize and replenish the skin for a tighter feel it's supposed to support circulation for a more lifted appearance and when I did some research on this gua sha technique one of the main things they said helps give the firming effect is the increased circulation to the skin and I certainly noticed that because as you're doing the rubbing your skin gets red which means the blood is rushing to the surface and the results in the study that the Dr. Brandt people did showed that after just one use this increased skin hydration by 104 percent and it is very moisturizing I have to say after four weeks of use which is right where I am 100 percent of people said they showed an improvement in skin elasticity and I feel so far so good and after eight weeks of use which is four more weeks from where I am right now 82 percent reported that the skin looked toned and firm and I'm going to go ahead and show you my four weeks results right now here's the before and after picture and as you can see in the before picture I have a good little turkey waddle going there and quite a few lines under my neck going down about the first three inches and in the after picture I think the turkey waddle has really firmed up and those fine lines and wrinkles are not nearly so pronounced I also feel like the skin looks more hydrated less dry it does have a much more toned appearance in my opinion and I did my best to keep the lighting exactly the same in the before and the after pictures and I really am surprised by the results I'm seeing from this I kind of thought I was going to come back and tell you that it was a bust quite honestly or just another gimmick but I plan to keep on using this and I'll report again at eight weeks and see if I can have still further improvement and some of the ingredients in the cream are what they call the slim sculpt complex which they say fights the effects of excess fullness and volume and gives a sculpted look to your neck and I feel like that has really happened and pea extract which helps improve the appearance of elasticity moisturizes and reinforces the skin and the hydrofirm complex which they say provides moisture hydration and helps prevent moisture loss and now I have not used this this morning so I'll go ahead and give you a little demo again of how this works I did that in the first video which I'll link below but you just take a little bit of this cream and because it is expensive this is $95 for this little kit I use just the smallest amount then I take the edge of this and just drag it up two three four five and I actually go to 10 and when I looked at other gua sha practitioners on the web they did it really fast and see how we're getting more redness there which means blood is coming to the surface of the neck there I'll go ahead and put the cream on the rest of my neck here then we'll do the other side two three four five six seven eight nine ten and you get a little wiggle at the top then we're gonna do the middle and they say to use this but I've really been liking just using the flat surface and I just go about 10 times up and it takes like no time it takes like two minutes I do it in the morning and the evening and look how red my neck is 
And so that blood is really rushing there, hopefully sending good reparative nutrients to my, I don't know if reparative is a word, but hopefully sending good blood supply and good nutrients to the surface of that skin. Another thing I've been doing with this, which they don't mention that you should do, but I take this serrated edge, and since I have makeup on, I'm not going to show you this, but I put a little of the cream along here, and then I just run it up like this in one of the serrated edges, and I do that 10 times on each side because I figure it doesn't hurt to try to keep that jawline a little firmer. And if you're not a subscriber and you'd like to be notified of that future video in four weeks to see if my neck gets better, then I hope you'll subscribe. And when you click that little bell, that just sends you email notifications of my future videos. Now, I also wanted to show you another little preparation that I've been using, and I just started this. This is the Amor Pacific Treatment Enzyme Peel and they call it a botanical exfoliator. And basically what it does, it's a general exfoliator that you can use, and I especially like it since I do use the Retin-A because sometimes I do get some peelies. And basically there is a little powder in here. You just get the surface of your skin just moistened with some water, then you just put a little bit of this powder in your hand and you rub it together, and then you gently exfoliate your skin from 30 to 45 seconds. And I noticed that when I did that, at first my skin was a little bit red, but by the next morning it looks just fine. And my skin was just smoother and had a little bit more of a glow. And I looked on Amazon at the reviews of this product and people are raving about it. They are saying that they're using it two, three, four, sometimes five times a week, and that it is really bringing on the glow to their skin. I didn't have a chance to use this more than twice. I've used it twice now and I like it so far but I'll keep using it and I'll report in a future video on if I think it brings back the glow. Now, I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day, and today is no exception. I've been using these Melody Beatty The Language of Letting Go cards, and we'll go ahead and we will choose a card, see what God has in store for us to think about for today. Ooh, learning lessons at work. Learning lessons at work. This is a good one for me right now, ladies. Today I will accept my present circumstances on the job. I will reflect on the fact that what I'm learning in my life applies to what I'm learning at work. I believe that I'm right where I need to be both at home and at my job. Friends, this is absolutely the perfect card for me and it actually kind of introduces something that I've been meaning to tell you about which is that my work has really, really heated up lately for me. As some of you who follow my channel may know, my sister and I own sort of an insurance company, and we do a variety of different things there, but one of the things we have is a national chiropractic network, and one of our biggest clients is the U.S. military. And veterans in 28 states have been accessing our chiropractic physicians, and veterans sometimes have really important needs in the chiropractic area. And since about November of this past year, my sister and I and the other women at our company, we have been increasing the size of the chiropractic network to blanket the nation for the veterans, and it has been horribly busy at work. I mean horribly. I used to be able to take off Friday afternoons. My sister and I have been in the business almost 23 years, and we figured at our more grown-up years that it would be nice to get Friday afternoons off, and we were able to do that until about the 1st of November, and since then, all bets have been off, and I have learned that I have to work my tail off at work. I almost feel like I'm going in the coal mine every morning. <laughs> I mean, it's like you go in, you put your head down, you work like a dog, you're exhausted, you come out of the coal mine at the end of the day, you know, brush off the soot and try to have a little bit of outside life. And for that reason, I have cut my videos down to one a week recently because I just can't be all things to all people. And unfortunately or fortunately, I make a lot of money at my company. And so that has to be my first focus. And I guess the lesson that I've been learning at work is first, that work is important and you have to make that job one. And secondly, sometimes you have to organize the other things in your life that you love to do around your primary responsibility, which is your work, and certainly in my case. And I know that was a lot of personal information about me. So just for today, I hope you'll look at the lessons you can learn at work, look at how work fits into your life, and appreciate the blessings that your work brings. Take care. See you next time.